wanted to quickly make this video so I could drive home a point uh, and maybe even make it a topic of debate. The fact that we chose com uh, capitalism over communism, and there's even a post about this recently, a, a, a meme, a mem, whatever you want to call it. And the point is, we chose it because we didn't want, you know, uh, a meager existence. We didn't want government handouts, rations, you know, our belongings and our our material and food and water governed by the government, right? So guess what's going to happen? Because we weren't able to, although we accepted capitalism and it might have even been, you know, needed at the time. <clears throat> it's no longer needed. It was actually somewhat of a mistake. Either way, we need to see this now because we didn't see it then. We didn't foresee that capitalism would drive something up through the ether called robots and they'd come and take our work. Uh, and they have systematically, starting with the cars, anything industrial, anything commercial, 3D printers. Um, now at the supermarkets, you go through, beep, beep, beep. In some supermarkets are mostly just the robots. Slowly, you know, factories are becoming run by robots. Uh, ports are becoming run run by robots. They're unloaded and loaded by robots now. Slowly but surely, there will be no need for human labor. Everything is going to be farmed by robots. As you see in Japan, the strawberry picking robots, everything. Okay, the light, the temperatures, all governed by robots. And there's not going to be any human jobs. Therefore, we're going to end up living on rations and handouts by the government, governed by the government, whatever they think is okay, whenever they think it is okay, however much they think is okay. So we've sleptwalked straight into communism through automation. It's called automation, what's happening when the robots come and take all the jobs. But everyone's so preoccupied with what's going on now, and tensions with Russia and entertainment and bullshit that we're not looking into the future, we're not designing the future, we're just sleepwalking into it. And there are people like me that sit around thinking about it, that have time to do that because I chose a different destiny, I didn't follow the path like everyone else. And I'm deemed as crazy, and will probably be laughed at. Oh, capitalism! Oh, it's so amazing. Communism! Oh, what's this guy talking about? Well, I just fucking rewatch the video if you want to know what I'm talking about. That's all I'm saying. As for a solution, because I can't just give you the problem without a solution, I propose a couple options: complete off-grid communities that are interconnected. Everyone's doing their own thing in separate places, not governed by anyone. Or they're all just micro-governed at tiny little places. And then we all, you know, can live and swap between the different places. Open source technology, everything's free, shared resources in these communities. Or whatever, these communities have their own little barter system, I don't care. But it's taken away the corporate power. Uh, and it's becoming our own robot masters, or we're going to be governed by the masters of the robots. We need to grow our own food. We need to get our own water sorted out. We need to get our own electric sorted out. We need to get our education sorted out, our information sorted out. We need to become less dependent on these people that are controlling everything and will soon be just beyond stoppable if they control all the robots and if they're handing out rations because there are no jobs. You know, billions of people on the planet and nothing for them to do. So, get off grid, get open source, start sharing. And then, of course, there's the resource economy, which at some degree would be governed, and it's a bit scary. And obviously, Jack Fresco's name gets tossed into it, and some people like him, some people don't, it doesn't matter. There are solutions out there. We need to be thinking about this, we need to be working on this. Otherwise, we're going to sleepwalk straight into it, and that's just fucking stupid. So there you have it, motherfuckers. Share this shit. Just fucking share it. Talk about it. Remake a video about it. Something. This needs to be fucking talked about. Thank you very much.